my camera just took the fattest tumble to the ground and to be honest i'm like shocked that it just turned on so anyways hello guys welcome back to my channel if you're new my name is mackenzie make sure to hit the subscribe button and stick around today i am back with one last swimsuit haul of the season as you guys know i am studying abroad this semester in florence italy and i've got tons of warm weather trips in the books we're off to croatia the amalfi coast and greece and it's still scorching hot here so i will be wearing a bathing suit on all three of those trips i'm super Super, super excited I figured I would pick up a couple of swimsuits to bring with me so yeah today's batch is from Zaffle they're running some amazing sales right now so if you guys are looking to stack up on some end of summer suits now is the time to do it you can stack those sales with my coupon code which I will leave here on the screen and down below along with links to everything so that you guys can shop Hope you guys enjoy and without further ado, let's hop right on. All right, gonna start off with my favorite bathing suit of the bunch. I absolutely love this suit. Not only is the color, the print super unique for me, but the style is so flattering. As you can see, this is like a dark hunter green with a mix of orange and brown flowers, like super unique, interesting color palette for me. But something about this I just love. It screams late summer transitioning into fall, if that's even a thing when it comes to swimsuits. I love this, it's orange on the other side and once you rip the tag off honestly you could make this reversible it's got those thinner straps along the sides and just a little silver ring which you guys know I love you can pull this style really high up on the hips and just elongate your figure slims down the waist and makes your legs look miles long absolutely love a little bit cheekier but so cute and then the top is just your classic little string style triangle top I love these they're super super flattering and they're really easy to cater towards your chest size I always just tie it in a knot and then in a bow in case your bow comes undone you're not going to be topless in the water I didn't bring a black bathing suit with me and I was really regretting that so I did pick up one basic black bikini and I love the bottoms to this suit they've just got more of your like standard fit they can be worn low rise but they can be worn a little bit higher up on the hips they've got about half inch band thickness along the back and then they are just the perfect amount of cheeky they really round out your tush and are super super flattering the top though is absolutely absolutely so small on this like look at the size of this cup you guys it's dinky so if you do have big boobs I would definitely recommend skipping out on this I'm like busting out of this top as it is definitely something that I could wear just tanning but if I were swimming or like going on a boat diving in and out of the water I would definitely skip out on this just because it is so tiny but very flattering all right next up I got this like turquoise suit and it's got a really interesting like toweling like texture to it I love this style later on in the summer the Sun is not as strong right now so you're not gonna be like burning or anything like that so you can have a little bit more cleavage on display and this wraps around the neck and you're not gonna get a wonky tan line this time of year wearing something like this these are so flattering if you have bigger boobs and you want to show off your cleavage that's definitely the kind of suit to do it in as for the bottoms they just look like this they are string style as you can see self tying along the sides they've got a really good amount of coverage along the front though and around the crotch. I know a lot of Zaffle suits can be kind of skimpy down there. I felt like these had a really good amount of coverage to them. They're a little bit fuller in the back. By all means, they still have your cheeks out, but... Yeah, overall, just a really great suit, and I love that color. This one is very similar to that last color. However, this is just like your typical swimsuit material, whereas the last one had a little bit of texture to it. These bottoms are very similar to the black ones that I showed you. They've got the same thickness, same amount of cheekiness. However, the only difference is that these bottoms have a cute little scrunch along the sides, and then they tie. I love this type of self-tie because it adds a fun little detail. However, if this does come undone, it's not like you're your bottoms are going to be falling off there's no chance of that happening so you have a little bit more security in a pair of bottoms like this they're great if you're going to be active in the water and then the top to this is just like your classic little bandeau style top when I first started wearing bikinis I wore tons of tops like this I really love strapless styles if you are laying out just you know sitting in the sun lounging reading a book whatever it may be this has those same little cinched bows along the side and super cute if you do have a larger chest I would recommend skipping out on those bandeau styles they don't have a lot of support to them and you tend to have a little bit of under boob. another amazing basic suit is this guy right here I am a sucker 
ever for white swimsuits, especially at the end of summer when you're really, really tan and this just kind of accentuates that. These bottoms are super cute. They've got just that classic fit to them. And then these ones actually have a knot along the side. So not a bow, not a cinch, nothing like that, but something to just kind of spice things up. These can be worn lower on the hips, but as you can see, I have pulled them up and this really slims down your waist, gives you more of that hourglass figure. I am actually like a pretty straight girl. I don't really have too many curves, no hips, nothing like that. So pulling that bathing suit up really can, you know, like alter your figure without actually doing anything to it. And then the top to this guy is one of my favorite styles. I really love these because they give you a very basic tan line. They don't move around when you're in the water. So they're kind of just like a great swimsuit no matter what you're doing all around. This has a little bit taller of cups and then it's got that little knot along the center. However, this one does have straps. They're thin, they're adjustable. And then the back of this does have that silver clasp to just kind of hold everything in place. This one also has removable pads. When it comes to white swimsuits, I never remove the pads just because I find that they can be a little bit see-through when they get in the water. If you leave the pads in, you should be fine. Apparently, I was just on a blue kick this time around. I got another suit that's got a little bit of teal in it. This one's like a light blue and then it's piped with teal and this is like a ribbed textured material. I love triangle style tops like this, as you guys know, and this one is no exception. Ties around the neck, ties around the bust. Very cute. The cups on that one are a little bit bigger than some of the other ones. So if you do have larger boobs, you are going to have a little bit more coverage in this suit as far as the top goes. It's kind of hard to gauge when you are shopping online, which is A, why I like to do these swimsuit reviews and show you guys what everything looks like on and in person. But if not, I highly recommend reading through the reviews and seeing if anyone's left a picture. As for the bottoms, this guy just looks like this. These ones are a little bit like narrower and cut along the front. I know I just said that some of the other ones had actually a little bit more coverage in the crotch. This one is definitely a little bit skimpier. It does still have those self ties along the sides and then it's got a pretty cheeky back to it. Double lined and this one has that white mesh on the inside. I love a good neutral swimmy. This one has basic bottoms but on the sides it's got like a few different cutouts. I really really love this style. I think it's so flattering and just adds a little bit something to a suit obviously without running the risk of it falling off little bit cheekier in the back so definitely gonna round out that tush and then at the top the top is tiny it's actually like it's got decent amount of coverage as far as height goes the problem is that look at how short this swimsuit is like it needs to be like two inches wider so that I don't have as much side boob I felt like my side boob was like spilling out of this but I love that little like dip in the center such a unique detail I also find that swimsuit tops like this that like have that straight across straight back top to it they just run smaller in general if you are a part of the itty bitty teddy committee I highly recommend checking out this style they're like perfect for you and they're gonna give you just a little bit of lift that you may not actually have um, but if you do have boobs I just find them they don't sit right and that's also where I messed up with the next suit because the next suit is pretty much the exact same style the only difference is that instead of the ring along the center this one actually has a self tie but as you can see the straps are still the same with this one I love this print something about this reminds me of like the cape cape cod i don't know it's very sweet very feminine i love the pads in this they're a little bit softer and thicker than some of the other ones very like comfortable soft material it's a lighter knit rib and the pads are removable on this guy but again just a little narrower along the sides i can still wear that swimsuit it's not like i won't get use out of it but i just want to put that out there that these styles do run a little wonky as far as sizing goes and then the bottoms just look like this this was probably the cheekiest bottom of them all definitely tiny coverage in the back and you do have self tying sides so make sure to double knot like I said I know this is white too, but this one was not see-through either. This was a really thick material, so. Yeah, that is going to be all for today's quick little swimsuit haul. I hope that you guys enjoyed. If you have any other requests that you would like to see right now, be sure to leave them down below. Don't forget to check out the description bar. I'll have shipping, sizing, links, coupon code, all that jazz down there. And I will talk to you guys very, very soon. Love you.